Okay, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? My name is Tetra Ninja and this is Postal 3 and as you can probably tell from that opening sequence this game is gonna be absolute shenanigans even more so than Saints Row the third. You probably have not even heard about this game the majority of you anyways but anyways this game is developed by a Russian development team and What's going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tetra Ninja and this is Postal 3 and as you can probably tell from that opening scene, this game is going to be absolute shenanigans even more so than Saints Row the 3rd. Saints Row the 3rd from what I've seen is going to look pretty tame in comparison to this game. Uh, this game was developed by a Russian development team and it's basically a satirical look from the outside of North American subculture and basically pokes fun at it, at it in every single way but anyways let's start a new game and we'll get right into it and you can see for yourself and we'll go start here with a man known only as the Postal Dude. Yeah, I hate that fucking name. Uh, okay, do you have a real name? Uh, I forget. Kids, don't do drugs. <laughs> Too much green health herb. Or meth. <laughs> Just kidding, kids. Do as I say, not as I do. Okay. So, I've read that you were in paradise before it was completely devastated by the unsolved nuclear incident. Yeah, due to an unfortunate uh, subprime mortgage malfunction, I was forced to relocate to a much nicer neighborhood with my beautiful wife. I'd just been hired by one of America's premier video game companies. Management decided that I was overworked and needed a sabbatical. Nothing personal, man, but you're fired. I used the time to check some errands off my list. Got Gary Coleman's autograph, that was pretty sweet. Picked up some steaks, played with elephants, went to confession, and visited <laughs> my dad's grave. Cause that's how I roll. Speaking of religion, weren't you at the Church of Dave compound during the massacre? Yeah, it was my Uncle Dave's birthday. I got him one of those bad touch crotchy figures. Those things were harder to get than strangle bait Elmo. Awesome park day at Dave's until the man showed up. I'm pretty sure they had the wrong address. Anyway, it wasn't really a religious cult. It's more like a cheap scam for Dave to hook up with Christian chicks. Apparently they go nuts for the whole. I am the reincarnation of Jehovah. Kneel down and watch me play a wicked guitar solo thing. I was impressed. Anyway, after my uh, unfortunate firearms accident, my beautiful <laughs> wife left me. I was devastated. By then, the neighborhood was lousy with sewer Taliban, and the mad cow Tourette zombie epidemic broke out. So me and Champ decided it was time to get out of town. Besides, about 20 other games were set in cities called Paradise by now. Right. So you were at the Paradise Municipal Bridge when the tragedy struck. Cross the bridge or die trying. <laughs> and like I said, as you can tell by that intro, it's all based on satire, mad cow disease, all that kind of stuff. I like the happy music that plays in the background <laughs> while this shit's going down. Alright, hide behind the car. Whoa! Shit! Jeez.
Zombies! Volts over stuff. Alright, easy enough. Scroll, scroll. P. Yeah! Mm. yeah. <laughs> oh, I ran out of P. P is my fist, too, apparently. Let's see here. Say, that's a perfectly good box of grenades. I'd hate to see them go to waste. Grenades. Sweet. Good, because I'm out. Oh, no, I'm not out of pee. I got pee again. <laughs> what? <laughs> Not so cute anymore. Alt fire to throw. Okay. Let's see here. Oh. What the? What the hell? We got back up again. <laughs> There you go, that taught you a lesson. Oh, sweet. Yeah! More grenades. Practice my John Elway toss right here. Man, these guys take a straight grenade to the feet. Don't die. Oh. Up with gasoline. Let's see this. I am the death panel. Try peeing on them for a bit. What happens? Oh, nothing fun happens. All right, let's do this. If I weren't meant to play with fire, why'd God make it so damn fun? Good question. Fire is pretty fun. I'm gonna freaking burn myself right here. I can sense it right now. I'm gonna set myself on fire. Mom always said not to play with fire, but I hate my mom. <laughs> All right. No. So that's what that smells oh. like. Yeah. Extra crispy. Bacon, bacon, bacon. Sweet. This bridge rules. There's useful shit lying all over the place. What? Spray, continue spraying to knock them out. Approach a stun enemy, press action to form a human shield. When you release the hostage, you break his neck. If you're a serious psycho, press alt fire to pepper spray. Okay, all right. All right, let's do this. Going nowhere. Oh, sauce. Shit, that's pepper spray. There you go. Come back here. Whoa. Yeah! Oh, now I'm on fire. Oh, no! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I'm out. How do I... If chronic was legalized, this sort of thing <coughs> wouldn't happen.
Thanks. Pepper spray. <laughs> Shield move. Oh, what? <laughs> All right, let's see here. We got some pepper spray. Let's do this. Left, go. Oh. I bet you thought you weren't going to die today. Oh, Surprise. shit. What the hell? Let's try his flamethrower deal. Mm, slow roasted uh -oh. goodness. Oh no. Smells like cremated chicken. Mommy! Come on. Stay down. I know this looks bad, but I'm actually a very nice person. Oh, I got a 16. Ugh. Oh. I don't feel so good. <laughs> Push the button. A shiny candy like button. Can I push? It? Nobody's looking. Maybe I can just press it a little bit. No choice. <laughs> Well, I'm convinced there was some kind of miscalculation that caused an unexpected incident with the bridge. Really? <laughs> That's fascinating. What happened? I kind of felt like my calling was elsewhere and decided it was time to move on. Plus, I had seen things. Horrible things. And, of course, there was that unfortunate nuclear deal that was totally not my fault. I, I mean, <laughs> whoever it was might not have even known it was a nuke they were arming. Probably. And Paradise was totally destroyed. Tragic. They still haven't found who caused that. Really? That's awesomely horrible. What a shame. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> We're at and sex shop so you now, ended up in Catharsis, Arizona. Yeah, my car was out of gas. Unfortunately, due to the global economic meltdown. You remember the global economic meltdown? Gas was retarded expensive. Luckily, one of the town's key industries was hiring, and I was perfectly qualified. Okay, champ, you wait out here. <laughs> Hello, anyone home? I'm here about the temp job. Hello? Good to meet you, kid. You're hired. Apparently, it was the cold season. Ron's patrons were littering the floor with sticky Kleenex balls. Ron gave me the tools for the job, explained how to use the old fire button to suck up and store the nasty byproducts. You. God. No graph out of date rebuilding. I don't even know what that means. But anyways, guys, I think that'll be good for episode one. So thank you guys for watching. Like I told you guys, this game is absolute shenanigans. Hopefully you guys are going to enjoy the series. This is going to be a very, very interesting walkthrough. And if you're going to enjoy it, 
uh, please give this very first video the biggest rating that you can, and I'll see you guys next time for some more Postal 3. All right, have a fantastic day.